Good morning, everyone. I will say this. If anything has come about from this experience, uh, getting locked out of my regular channel for a week. <laughs> a week? Seems like a long time. Or it seems like just enough time to establish the backup channel and turn it into something worthwhile. And I think we can do that. Now, one day, <clears throat> one day in, and uh, this really goes out to Mike or anyone who is from the other channel who come over. <clears throat> we had a lot bigger algorithmic problems on the other channel. Obviously, uh, old Roland. Uh, speaking of that, uh, Sean, I do try to keep it as real as I can. I like to rock out. I like to have fun, but I think it's okay to question all sides of a narrative. I, I'm straight crazy, but I, I try to honestly stick with this. I don't think I should tell anybody anything, but I think it's permissible to ask any question I want. Now, it's, it's very obvious that's not true anymore. Uh, I'm over here starting this channel because I couldn't even look at a controversial uh, movie, speak on it, admitting I was wrong without it uh, coming back to haunt me. So obviously we are in that uh, know who you can and can't talk about and remember they are a protected group. <laughs> But I will be keeping it as real as always because that's, that's all I know how to do. Uh, Mark, Captain Kurt did a breakdown. It might help. Uh, I might check into it. The honest truth is outside of watching uh, that the information I wanted was so I could know what Upchurch clips I should check out. Uh, we're back with some Upchurch this morning by you, which I think has some multiple play on words there. Uh, something new from J.J. Lawhorn and Upchurch from uh, just a few hours ago. So uh, here's the deal. I tend not to watch any reactors now that I became one. I liked reactors until I started doing it. I don't ever want to pick up someone else's rhetoric and deliver it like I thought it or, uh, you know, outside of the artists themselves or pulling stuff out of my crazy tinfoil hat brain but i tend not to uh do research from other reactors and i hope and much respect to them all i just don't want to be influenced by other people's content uh, i kind of like going with whatever my my crazy is so uh gary uh I, well you could think it's all for you there's nothing wrong with that and, uh, uh, well, uh, maniacs, uh, the whole the bandmaids, the stuff, uh, I have, uh, really like bandmaid, really like love bites, uh, Nemophila, uh, I think that's right. I'm shit with their name. It means flower though. It means a flower. I know that much. Uh, I really like them cause I like the guitarist who plays in that uh, Lisa X, uh, I think the, the ladies of Japanese progressive metal are some of the baddest musicians on the planet. And even if the whole thing started as a, a good idea, it has turned into uh, a musical force from a region to be reckoned with. Uh, if I knew more about that show that they do with all of the band, I don't know enough, but I'll say this. I know enough that I would never stop listening to the band. I just think they're fantastic. I really do enjoy their music. And uh, should be links all over the videos to the other channel where there's tons of content from the ladies. And uh, lots of weird rolling crap. Uh, what's, the, what's the one where they're by the edge of the uh, uh, quarry? I, uh, I really like that. That... Uh, the discussion was the top 10 holes you could see from space. 
It's a very interesting discussion. Uh, fun. But uh, thank you, one and all, for the new subs overnight. For uh, uh, If anybody needs to know, Mike Henry in the comments, he's uh, been around. Well, he's been, been a constant uh, supporter in my uh, my gig here for damn near a year. So he's been along for the whole ride. Uh, Jenny, thank you for subscribing. Uh, and Daniel uh, Armstrong, raising hell and eating cornbread. Uh, I appreciated that info. That's where I was going to start digging with that. Uh, uh, Paul, I'm, I'm glad you liked uh, all opinions are for entertainment purposes only. I think we should all be able to have the discussions. Not be afraid of it. And I certainly don't need a single corporate overlord telling me what I can and can't hear. I would say that context is really important. I, we, we could discuss anything when you apply context and direct feelings or thoughts. Well, sure, it might be different, but a discussion's a discussion and... Uh, I definitely struggle with this idea that we're not supposed to question things anymore. Trust me, I, I know we're supposed to question shit. Uh, Mike, thank you for uh, doubling down. I just, you know, Chad Armas, first day of the channel come up, man come over, checked out the video, and gave us some love. I, I can't, can't tell you how much I appreciate that. Just the coolest thing. And, uh, just a couple of us. Here's the deal. You stick around long enough, you'll just be a bus rider. Uh, we're going to be fueling the bus. That's what we call getting to some heavy stuff today. Uh, we're going to start out with some lounge activity. That's uh, 420 friendly. Up church and others. Because uh, uh, I'm not anti-weed yeah, yeah, not anti -weed either. So, I mean, if those are things that are offensive, I'll be clear right from the get-go. Uh, I won't uh, disparage certain uh, lifestyle choices. I just ask, uh, you know, weigh consequences. So, you know, it's cool. All right, I think that's going to cut this one, uh, call this good. And, uh, well, okay, here yeah. Got Up Church, Long Live the South with J.J. Lawhorn, Bayou, Up Church. Dragon Force, The Last Dragonborn. We'll see if this works. I don't know. Uh, the ABBA cover by some crazy uh, Napalm Records deal. I've covered them once on the other channel. For Schwaus? I, I, I don't know how to say that. Uh, Tommy. Uh, Majestica or Rainseed uh, tune. The Light. Just because he thinks they should have some more viewers. More viewing and uh, VOP, uh, not public property because uh, VOB is just. Um, well, I like talking about uh, our rights and our freedoms and what we all should be allowed. And I don't care if it runs from the girls or to, you know, all the way into the, you know, the boys. I don't care what group. Silencing, uh, repressing, shackling, binding. Any sort of oppression, blah, 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 blah. I just don't dig none of that shit. Um, and if the media and the mainstream can scream this stuff at the top of their lungs, we can push back. I don't recognize none of it. I don't recognize this stuff. I recognize the struggle for more. That's why we'll visit some more VOB. But I don't, I don't recognize... Um, this pick and choose whose unheard voice gets to resonate next. Let's start listening to all the unheard voices and all, all those screaming from the top, top of their uh, crystal castles. Shh. I think we've heard enough from you. Let's, let's shut it and let the regular folks. Because uh, the problem is the person with 15 supercars and a luxury mansion and yacht, they don't actually drive the regular economy. They don't drive shit. They drive the darkest sides of this world. Sorry. But everybody who goes down to the local wood shop here and puts in their 40 plus, the town stays alive because of them. See, anyone can own the grocery store. 
as long as the grocery store is there to, to serve the community. The person who's profiting off that doesn't actually, isn't that big of a deal as they strut around town? Who really cares? I, I'm, I'm cool with co-ops because it's the people that, that struggle together that make it all happen. That's just a fact. So uh, this is the kind of stuff gets people fired up sometimes. I don't know. It's just how I like to. It's who I am. Let's get on with some reactions today. Later.